Okay. So you are giving this because you don't want people eating meat. But here you have uh, this uh, oil pile, okay. which is really bad because in Indonesia they destroy the, the forest, the rainforest, to do this uh, uh, palm tree forest instead, burning the forest, and you are giving this. What is um? What did you think of what you seen on the uh, screen? You already talked about it, but. Uh... What did it, how did it make you feel to see that, to the animal? My, I don't have any feeling for the animals. You don't feel for them? No. Oh, okay. No. So I, I told you, you are going oh. to be disappointed. No, that's okay, that's okay. Some people don't, some people don't. But would you agree that um, if, if it's not necessary to do that to them, to survive, then... No, this is our responsibility oh. to check what we are buying and okay. what we are putting in our plates. Like, and uh, I'm okay. not. Uh, I'm against such kind of production, oh, okay, mass production. Of course, yeah. I'm against. That's why I stop eating meat regularly. And when I have to buy meat, to buy meat, yeah. I check where the meat is coming from. So there's no cruelty in the meat. It's not what. So there's no cruelty. You check if there's no cruelty. Exactly. Okay. Do you think um, because the animal was killed that? The, the act of killing the animal itself is cruelty? Like taking the animal's life? No, we have to. We have to? We have to. To survive? Not to survive. Not to, it's not a question of uh, survival. survival. It's just a question of uh, uh, the need of the body. The need? The need. So what do we need from the body? We need calcium, we, we need iron, oh, yeah. we need, uh, and this cannot be provided by the, by the plants. Oh, where does the animal get the calcium and the iron from in their body? Where we, have, why, why where we need, it, like, where does the cow get the, the, the iron and the calcium from? No. The, in their body, the, the nutrient, how do they get that in their body? Do you know? So, uh, the, from the they plants. They are vegetarian. They are vegetarian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, if if all the protein and iron and calcium but originally, we don't have the same need as a cow, as a human being. Well, let's just say. Uh, well, I've been vegan four years. Yeah. Like healthy but blood tests. Prote I can get protein and yeah. iron. But you are young. Yeah, yeah. We can. So you are pretty young. I'm 50. Yeah. And I know. I'm, I've got anemia. And anemia. Yeah. Okay. And I need to eat meat regularly. For iron. For iron. Okay. And it's not because uh, plants. So there is a legend saying that in in the plant, in the cruciform, you can find the iron that we need. It's not true. The body is not able to assimilate this iron coming from cruciform. Who said? The, the, do scientist. the doctor. The scientist. The scientist. Have you uh, seen any of the science into plant-based diet? How it's reversing yeah. our number one killer, heart Biologist. disease. Oh, you seen the what it's doing to heart disease? Reversing it. Plant-based diet. It's the only diet known to reverse our number one killer. Did you know that? No, I didn't understand. Oh, so, a plant-based diet, one that consists of only plants, yeah. is the only diet known to reverse our number one killer, which is heart disease, which kills more people than war and cancer combined. No, no, no. You are mixing all the problems. You are mixing all the problems. No, no, it's, all um, this kind of uh, disease are what? due because people are eating too much and oh. are not doing sport and have a bad uh, life. Well, like, uh, there was a no, sports, no, sportsman still can get heart disease, it builds up in your arteries. It's uh, cholesterol, no, yeah? I don't want... I, 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 like, it's... Uh, no, I, I'm not sure whether it's good to start from one extreme and to finish at the other extreme. Extreme. Vanishing everything coming from uh, animals. animals. Okay. So, I'm not sure. I think the, we have to find the right balance. Yeah. And the body, okay. the human body, needs some calcium, iron and all the other minerals coming from animals. Okay. So, you know, what we have to do is just to check how yeah. these animals are produced, how these products are produced okay. in order to, yeah, to be... Uh, what, if, um, what, if I, what if there's a possibility that you can be healthy as a vegan? But have you because, looked? In, have you yeah, looked into this? I'm, I'm, There's about half a million vegans I'm here in really Israel. I'm really curious to. I will be no, probably not anymore on this earth. Yeah. To see in 50 years if we're still alive. You will. St you will probably be still alive, but in which condition? Like we've had. Let's just say we can get healthy blood tests and show you that we're getting calcium and iron and protein. Would that make you think? Would that make you go, wow? I didn't know that you could get calcium from plants. Would you be surprised if you could find healthy vegans? Yes. You'd be surprised? I will. Wow. How about, would, would you, if I gave you information on health, 
and you, you looked into it because you're a biologist, yeah. and you looked into it and you've seen, wow, there's science to back up a vegan diet, yeah. and then would you think it's not necessary to kill animals for food if it's not, we're not doing it for health? Like if you find out we don't need to? I will. You would say it's I, not necessary? I, I will maybe reconsider my position. Wow. That is amazing because I'll show you right here. There's this new documentary. It's called What the Health. It's here and yeah. they present the science, okay? Yeah. And below is nutritionfacts.org. Yeah. Now this guy, all he does is he goes into the scientific literature yeah. and he pulls out peer-reviewed journals. You know what peer review does? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he pulls out peer reviewed journals and he gives you all the information that there is yeah. in the scientific literature on plant based diets and what they do for so, our health. What is your opinion concerning the palm tree forest in Indonesia, Malaysia? And ah. Well, I think, I think, I think if we were to talk about the rainforest, the number one cause of Amazon deforestation, 91% yeah. is caused by cutting down the, the trees to grow soybeans yeah. to feed to livestock so we so, can eat their bodies. So when and this you think about having this... Um, so like, so eating animals is destroying the rainforest more than palm no, oil. I have a lot of respect for your, yeah. for your fight, yeah. ah, for I, the I, energy I, that you put in this fight. You seem passionate as well and intelligent as well. You, you understand um, you, you have logic because you're a biologist, you use logic in biology, yeah? yeah? And you rely on facts and information, yes. yeah? So if there's facts and information that go against... What about this uh, okay, chocolate so, uh, bar? So palm With, oil... Uh, palm oil uh, okay, inside. So, so palm you oil... Are, so you are, you are really so tough in one, one fight for the animals, but on the other hand you are giving to everybody some chocolate bar containing... Palm oil plantations are causing tremendous deforestation in Indonesian rainforest. It is estimated that palm oil is responsible for 26 million acres being cleared. Though, compared to livestock and their feed crops, they were responsible for 136 million acres of rainforest lost to date. There's palm oil in there, and yeah. palm oil hurts some, so some maybe animals. So you should be... Well, I'll, I'll put it... Have you heard this? Veganism is causing the least amount of harm in the society that we have, okay? So, instead of, like, our clothes, things that, by existing, we cause some amount of harm, yeah? We can't, we can't avoid that unless and your we... your t-shirt was uh, yeah. made where? We can't, exactly, we can't avoid some harm on living on this earth. No, but, no, it's just... But to cause the maximum amount of harm by chopping up no, animals on one, top of that? No, the, you have one fight and it's respectable. Well, this but is that's... easy. We're talking about grabbing soy milk instead of dairy milk, but about I grabbing... I to be more... Uh, you, more balanced yeah, but and be aware of many things like oh, yeah. the chocolate bar, your Even t shirt coming from Bangladesh. We could always Bangladesh, get, we could always and, get uh, um, and uh, still yeah. having my uh, steak once a month in order not to have anemia. But what, what, more what, do you know that? Well, what if you could, if you tried veganism for 30 days here on the back? 30 days. That's all you have to commit to. It's free. You get a, a sign of free I'm not going to try 20 not, days. No, 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 no. 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 Okay. But I'm sorry. No, that's okay. That's at least you being honest. We had a good conversation anyway, but maybe look at the health side. I will, I will have a look. Have a look. And, uh, have a look. Just the health side and see if it, if it changes your mind. And if not, it was a good conversation anyway. I hope. Thank you very much. Ciao. And uh, <laughs> take your uh, old pine. Palm, palm, oil. palm oil chocolate. Yeah. It's, not it's, it's not good for the and environment. It's not good for the environment. Well, your next uh, fight should be this one as well. Yeah, definitely. Once we stop animals going to slaughterhouses, then we can look at other things as well. <laughs> Thanks, brother. Ciao. Thanks, mate. But you know, we're just saying, if it's not necessary, there's things obviously that we wear and use that cause harm. But this is obvious, it's obvious, it's right there, it's a dead body, with, they didn't need to die, they're suffering. I don't have, you know. I don't, I don't know whether it's a good argument to say it's a dead body. Oh, oh the meat isn't a dead body? No, the cow, the chicken, and uh, so they are dead body, but uh, oh, they, and they suck, need. yeah. So the oh, yeah, yeah, but, but remember, we're gonna check if we need I mean, it. You like the taste, maybe? Maybe no, you like the taste? No, don't enjoy You don't enjoy I don't enjoy it, but I know. Wow, don't. you don't enjoy it, but you really do it because you because think you I've need got, it for health. Because I've got anemia. Do you know that dairy inhibits iron absorption? I know. It inhibits it. I know. Yeah, so that would be one thing to cut exactly. out. Well, yeah. it's, it's only accepted for uh, meat. Animal. They it's actually bacteria that's found in the grass, uh, in the dirt, and in water. It's not a bacteria. It's a, B12 is a bacteria. No. 
Yeah. No. B12. Yeah, and it converts to a vitamin. Two biologists. Well, what is, where does it originate from, B12? By, by cells, by, by the cells of your body. Where does it originally come from? Inside of you? Yeah. Then why do we need to ingest it? You synthesize it. We so why do we need to ingest it from out eating animals? Because your body does not produce enough. much enough. Okay. And the cow doesn't have it. So you can eat a thousand of tons of uh, grass and not get enough iron? And at, will at the end, the American Dietetic Association, which is the biggest health organization, nutrition organization, in the oh, world, yeah. says uh, that there is no difference in anemia rate between uh, vegans and non vegans. Yeah. So you get enough iron. The People can eat meat and still not have enough iron. It's absorption. That's the problem. Yes. Let's make a deal. We'll check okay. ourselves. We'll check ourselves. So, and, uh, we'll do research on B12. Is that you're talking to two PhDs? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Biology? And you're thinking you're all right? It doesn't matter. It's no, not. If, if no, B12 isn't found in the dirt, I'll, I'll take no, back everything I've said. So take care. Eat sometimes uh, a piece of meat and you will see you uh, you will be much... I'd rather die of iron deficiency than eat meat. <laughs> <Okay. Okay. laughs>